What's up, YouTube? Else Entertainment Outdoors back at you again in another video. Uh, I'm gonna be doing something a little bit different. Uh, I don't know if you can hear them in the background. I'm sure you can. Uh, I'm in my building right now. Uh, this is gonna be a series. It's gonna be raising Cornish Cross, how to raise them and butcher them, process them, and all that good stuff uh, to eat for me, for our family. Uh, ordered 35, is it 35? 35 Cornish Cross from Murray McMurray Hatchery. This will be our second time doing it this year. We done them in the spring. We done, I mean, we do 30. We done 30 in the spring. We decided to go with 35 this time. Uh, haven't opened them. I don't know if any of them's dead. What's going on with them? Uh, so we're gonna open them up. I'll show y'all a little setup I got real quick. Uh, it's just a 110 gallon uh, stock tank from Royal King. I hooked my heat lamp up here and I drilled my two by four on it so it wouldn't fall in there and catch anything on fire. Put about two to three inches of pine shavings in the bottom. Um, I'm gonna, every day I'll come out here and I'll put some more so they're not running around in nasty poop and stuff. Uh, but this, like I said, this is gonna be a series. Uh, we'll do a video every week, show you the progress on them. Uh, but right now we're gonna introduce them to the tank, see if all of them is alive and healthy. And you get a bonus chicken. I don't know what kind it is. It could be furry leg, I don't know. So we're gonna open them up and see if they're all alive. I ain't gonna open this thing. Okay. Staple it. Okay, they all appear to be alive and healthy right now. Um, you can tell this is a Cornish cross. They're cute, but they're gonna be for a freezer. And I guess this is the bonus chick. I don't know what kind of chicken it is. We'll find out when it gets a little bit older. Right now I'm gonna count them and introduce them to their, to their brooder. I'm gonna stick them in them, touch their beak to the water, let them get familiar with it. There's two. Actually, I'm not gonna do them all like that because they'll figure it out. There's four. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. 19, 20, 21, 22, 25, 29, 31, Hold on. 32. 33. No, 32. 33. 34. 35. 36. They sent me an extra one, I guess, in case one dies of the way here. 37 makes the bonus check. You can see they ship them from the day they're hatched. Only takes a day or two to get here. Uh, good job, Murray McMurray Hatchery. Both times I've ordered them, they've all been happy and healthy. Um, we'll go through, like I said, once a week. We'll let y'all know how many, if any, dies. Hopefully it's none, but most likely you're always going to lose one or two. You can see some of them's done found food, water, they're drinking. So like I said, just stay tuned for this series. 
be once a week all the way up to processing day. Last time, how long they go? Nine weeks. You can butcher them anywhere from six to on up to 12, whatever weeks, but try to aim for eight, nine, uh, six, seven pound chickens. Uh, we'll weigh them once a week, see their progress, show you all that. So stay tuned. Hope y'all like this content. If you would, just please like, share, and subscribe.